what's going on my name is rodney welcome back to the channel hey i'm thinking about maybe doing another upgrade with my solar system if you guys have been watching my channel any you know that i have a 12 kilowatt system i have three of the grow out inverters and i'm able to partially run all my house you know off grid depending on if the sun's out or whatever as you can see you know if i go outside here you can see right now the sun it's about five o'clock the sun is basically west of my panels let's go ahead and see what we're pulling in right now and on my one array i'm pulling in for about 1400 watts on the other one 1375 so basically 2800 watts let's say on uh both these inverters and of course my third inverter i don't have a string a solar on it as you can see they were pulling in about 2800 watts and a lot of times in the evening right now i'm not using a lot of power but a lot of times in the evening i'm going to be using more power at this time than any other time of the day between five and eight o'clock and that's usually when the sun is going to be going down and getting low in the sky and i'm just not pulling in enough power off my 12 kilowatt array you know it's pulling in 2800 watts so if i have one facing west i'm thinking that i can get a lot better efficiency for the last few hours of the day when i really need it so i'm just wondering if i should go with the same panels i got the solar rivers or if I should go with some bifacials. I'm thinking about going with some bifacials just to try them out. If you do have some bifacials, and especially if you made them a west facing array, let me know down in the comments below how it's working out for you. If I have that bifacial facing west, maybe it'll still get some sun during the day, and then in the evening, it'll get the best sun when it's facing directly at it. What have you guys done? You know, I definitely need uh, um, more solar panels because days that my, my power usage is very high, even with the sun out, if my battery's got low at night and it's trying to charge those back, you know, it can pretty much get them charged back. But then at the end of the day, it's draining them down the last couple hours that the sun's going down because I'm using so much power at that time. Should I go with a west facing uh, solar array or at least do some testing with that? And if I do, what panels you think would be the best? Maybe the signature solar. They have some Canadian solar ones. I think they're like maybe... 400 watt ones and they might go up to 520 or something like that maybe trying some of those out and seeing how they do you know maybe during the day it'll still get some sun on the back part and still be able to produce some power throughout the day but then do the most that last few hours that last three or four hours of the day when i'm really needing that power bump so let me know in the comments below what do you guys think more panels i mean i don't i can't really get more batteries i don't have my my ray is only 12 kilowatts so it's not gonna be able to charge more batteries and still be able to run the whole house all day. So I'm thinking the only thing I can really do at this point is more panels. So if you guys got any ideas, hey, let me know that in the comments below. And if you like this kind of video, hey, go ahead and hit a subscribe button, hit the like button, and thanks for watching.